Hey guys, Joshua Peterson here with Peterson Electric. It is um, November 2018. Um, I want to thank you guys for um, watching our videos and I just want to make sure that you understand um, a few things about terminology in the electrical field. A lot of us are going to differ between what we call single phase or L1, L2. I, I know the correct terminology is to say it's single phase with two legs or three phase with three legs and I understand the square root of three is 1.73 which basically means that in a full circle of a cycle of 60 hertz that your sine wave is collapsing um, 120 degrees out of cycle whereas on 180 degrees is going to be 360 on of that is going to be your single phase so your two legs are collapsing there as well. Um, this is why the neutral can be shared on a single phase or two legs and then three phase can be shared also on a, on a single neutral on three legs. I do understand the difference of the fact that it's 12208 three phase Y system on a transformer tap which is a center tap on your Y and I also understand that there is going to be a 120 240 uh, corner delta tap. You could also have a center delta, um, but typically you're going to see a high leg on your B phase, which is your, uh, I think it's an article 240 if I'm not mistaken, but it has an orange tape taped around that. And uh, basically that's going to show you that B leg is hot. And you can use that typically on a motor that's three phase, of course, uh, that's going to have a 480 draw or 240 draw three phase. Um, but typically on that high leg, I have seen it on A and C phase in small older commercial buildings in Fort Collins years ago. Um, so I do look at that stuff when I bid it. You don't always see me take out things and talk about that. I don't do a ton of commercial right now because we're a smaller company, but we do a lot of custom residential homes and a ton of service calls and tons of remodels for kitchen, bath, and additions and things like that. So um, I still am familiar with those terminologies. I do apologize if I've messed a couple of those up. I know you guys have been stuck out on some of those and I keep getting hammered on that. Hopefully this video will help you understand that terminology is terminology. Um, the other thing that I wanted you to keep in mind is that um, if you have certain things that you want to let me know about, we'd love to hear that. I had a guy the other day uh, tell me terminology of a bootleg on a neutral, and then he suggested a meter for me to look at because I was at a, on a video for underground for something that was uh, tripped out, and then he also says you can see that inside the house as well. So I love hearing those different terms uh, because every I had a guy from Australia telling me his terms were different, and another guy in, uh, I think it was Sweden. So again, these videos are hopefully meant to help each other out. We all have different things. We have 50, they got 50 hertz cycle in Europe, and we got 60. What does that really mean? It just means though how the motor operates and how quickly the sine wave collapses so I do understand a lot about terminology again I've been doing this 21 years I was an appliance technician for three years um, and we did a lot of different tracing hot of course um, so anyways thanks guys for joining us I'm glad you're watching our videos and we'll talk to you soon